As Italy emerged from the scars of the First World War, political and social unrest intensified, turning the country into a fertile ground for the rise of Benito Mussolini and his fascist movement. The aftermath of the war left Italy in a state of widespread discontent, with the population seeking solutions to instability and economic challenges. The National Fascist Party, established in 1921, emerged as a seemingly robust response to citizens' concerns. Mussolini, with his unique charisma and exceptional oratory skills, adeptly interpreted public discontent, giving voice to dissatisfaction with post-war agreements and capitalizing on the spreading fear of communism throughout Europe. March on Rome In this context, the March on Rome in 1922 became a crucial milestone. This event was a massive demonstration led by Mussolini and his followers, marching towards the Italian capital to demand political change. The march served as a display of strength and determination, marking a decisive moment in the consolidation of Mussolini's power. The perceived intimidation by the fascists led King Victor Emmanuel III to appoint him as prime minister, formally initiating the fascist regime in Italy. The March on Rome was not merely a symbolic gesture, but a strategic move that allowed Mussolini to assume a central role in the Italian political landscape. Its success provided him with the necessary legitimacy to establish a strong and authoritarian government. This episode marked the beginning of the fascist era in Italy and propelled Mussolini into leadership, laying the groundwork for the political and social transformations that would follow in the 1920s. Consolidation of Fascist Rule over the course of the 1920s, Mussolini wielded his authority with unwavering determination. He systematically quelled political opposition, laying the foundations for the creation of a totalitarian state that exerted its influence across every facet of Italian life. This marked a transformative period wherein Mussolini's grip on power became increasingly unyielding. Mussolini's vision, characterized by nationalism and authoritarianism, extended beyond a mere quest to restore Italy's former greatness. It encompassed ambitious objectives such as territorial expansion and economic revitalization, reflecting a comprehensive agenda to propel Italy into a position of prominence. His strategic foresight aimed not only at addressing domestic issues, but also at positioning Italy as a significant player on the global stage. The consolidation of Mussolini's authority during the 1920s unfolded as a complex interplay of political maneuvering, suppression of dissent, and the articulation of an expansive vision for Italy's future. This period laid the groundwork for the transformative actions that would follow, setting the stage for a regime that sought not only domestic control but also international influence. Path to World War II the emergence of the Axis with Nazi Germany under Hitler in the 1930s marked a pivotal stage. Mussolini, recognizing the necessity of projecting Italy's influence globally, forged this strategic alliance. This pact further solidified his position as the leader of a regime advocating national superiority, earning him the title Duce, symbolizing unquestionable leadership and evoking the grandeur of the ancient Roman Empire. As the 1930s progressed, the fascist regime intensified its control over all aspects of Italian society. Participation in the Spanish Civil War and the invasion of Ethiopia in 1935 were significant events that markedly paved the way to World War II. The signing of the Pact of Steel with Nazi Germany in 1939 solidified the alliance between Mussolini and Hitler, paving the way for Italy's entry into the global conflict on the side of the Axis. In summary, Mussolini's ascent in the era of fascism in Italy until 1939 were not only political phenomena, but decisive episodes that shaped the events leading to World War II. Their impact left an indelible mark on Italian and global history, defining an era that transformed the destinies of nations and redefined the international political landscape. <laughs>